Hello YouTube and Happy New Year. This will be most likely my last video for 2020. And I had such high hopes for 2020 because it started great. And then you know what happened, the virus. And uh, of course, uh, I should not complain as I'm not the only one suffering and uh, not to mention of uh, all the people that passed away because of uh, the virus but then again uh, there are many people dying from smoking or alcohol and uh, nobody's concerned about those people or from cancer for that matter how many people do die from cancer and the cure is swimming out there in the ocean as you might know sharks do not get cancer so if they don't get it they must have something against cancer but then we're just exploring Mars because we think we're gonna live there and uh, I mean come on fix the world where all the people live and don't think about fixing it up for Mars so you can put a handful of people living there in uh, I mean come on who wants to live on Mars if you have a such wonderful world here that you're screwing up every day with all the emissions and whatnot and then you're spending those millions and billions of dollars to live on Mars I mean uh, for me it's common sense use that money to fix the world use that money to get rid of all the viruses and whatnot that kill people I mean who wants to live on Mars? What good does it... I mean, what, you're gonna destroy Mars as well? Because, I mean, that's what's gonna be ending up with. Mars is perfectly fine the way it is now. Fix the world we live in. Care for the world. Care for the people that live on this world. And uh, anyway, I wasn't gonna say all this. I might even not upload this video just because of this, because I'm gonna get an, a lot of haters, most likely. But anyway, I am going out with a big bang. Uh, <clears throat> I'm sorry, not really. But today I did receive my displays. And uh, that's why I am happy. Which means I can keep working over the new year so anyway I wanted to open this first for my security and uh, this is how I would like packages to arrive from China this is not only a hard box there's also soft uh, foam around it wrapped around it the only thing I don't get is what this means. Goods not fulfilling the conditions laid down in the articles 28-29. Mainly I should read those. Treaty of function of the European Union. So I'm receiving two displays here in the par uh, in a few par <laughs> a few connectors and I am not fulfill goods are not fulfilling the conditions. I mean come on people, don't you have something better to do? So anyway, long story short, let's cut this baby up. I don't think I will destroy anything by doing so. Yes, that's what I... Oh, this... Uh, well, I guess I just found the company that I'm gonna deal with when I order a million of these displays. Not really, I wish. But... Uh, Sorry for, I hope you are not wasting your time. But then again, you do have a pause button or you can stop watching the video if you don't like it. And if you want to waste your time, you can write me a negative comment about how I, how I didn't show anything useful to you. But this is about these displays. And this is how I would like to this place to get packaged because otherwise let me show you you end 
up like this. These are all 1.3 inch broken displays. Most of them. Some of them I drew out. So this is what you get if they don't do this. Anyway, let's take them out. Oh, I'm really, really glad that these things did arrive because they have a slightly different, um, slightly different driver chip that I need to test and uh, try. Uh, by the way, these are some connectors, 3.5 inch, I don't even know how to, oh, I love them, 3.5 inch IPS capacitive touchscreen displays, and the uh, three seemingly not important letters ips means this thing is fully sunlight readable which this thing is not so and i like it i like how thin it is i do like it i have to look around my phone camera to see yes it has some capacitors and chips on here which I need to take into consideration when I design the PCB so it will lay flat which I'll actually this one, this one does already so yeah I do like this and these are the connectors that I ordered with it Let me show them to you. So this is a breakout board, so I can test the display um, externally. And these are the connectors for to put on the PCB. I did use type of connectors like this before on my VGH project. And these are the smaller ones for the touch display controller that is on a separate you can see here that is on a separate uh, connector apart from the display and uh, yes I do like it and I am very very excited and this will go into this well not really into this but into this let me zoom in this is based on this so this is a test 3d printed version which I'm not gonna use obviously this is what I have manufactured in China it's CNC milled out of a solid aluminum piece and it's anodized for now I did pick um, I don't know if they made it clear or silver but that's what I wanted to first actually have the contrast between uh, silver and you can see my gray hair and uh, anyway this is the case that I had manufactured and you can see I don't know why it's uh, the video is zooming in and out anyway it has the 10 holes for NeoPixels, obviously I cannot live without them. And um, well, this is the front. Uh, I will use, as you can see, these displays are pretty reflective, which is not the best thing. I will use this with a matte screen protector which will take off the glare and eliminate fingerprints which fingerprints was always something I that hindered me using touch displays and also before you could only get uh, touch screens with the resistive uh, resistive touch screens which is a layer of two foils on top of the display which just makes it look ugly I don't like it I never 
bought them. I never used them. And uh, capacitive is so much better. And if you're picky like I am, uh, it makes a big difference. So anyway, I was very glad to have received the first unit uh, from Maker Fabs and found my love with the 3.5 inch color display and then I did look and find um, look and find and found the IPS version of them and uh, had to buy them and this will be my next go-to project because I will make several um several different products based on this sorry i just had to pause the video for a second so anyway this will be my next go to product project um whatever it will end up being so this is it guys and um, anyway sorry about my rant at the beginning of the video i don't know where that came from but it's just um, crazy stuff going on in the world and uh, i hope yes i actually <laughs> i do hope that 2021 will be if it's just a little bit better it might help a lot and um, yes i don't want to drag this on i wish everybody a happy 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 healthy wealthy new year uh, i'm just glad if i can find money to buy parts because i definitely i'm not gonna get rich nor do i want to been there done that uh, that brings a whole lot of other problems um but i just want to be able to put my ideas into actual products and um, for that well without money you cannot make money and i also want to thank my seven patreons i'm down from nine so and I also thank you for using my links on Banggood, my affiliate links. Uh, it's not a lot, but it does help and every little helps, even if I can just uh, order some PCBs with the money that I'm getting. That is a uh, uh, help uh, in itself. So anyway, this was about past and next year and um oh, i just couldn't see it on this one before it does have a screen protector on there obviously and i cannot wait to put this next to this and see the difference uh, anyway this is it uh, thank you for your support thank you for your comments and thank you for sticking with me this year Thank you for buying one or two of my products and um, as I said, have a happy new year and I talk to you on the next one. Take care everybody.